You see, what we need is not what we can conceive of. It's what God can conceive of. In his completeness, in his loveliness, in his wonderfulness. We need what we cannot conceive of. So we just long for him. Long for the continual presence of the goodness of God. We have been in this world for a time and experienced both good and evil and the contrast of it. And obviously we don't like evil. We long for God. My soul longs for you. My soul longs for you. Nothing else will do. Nothing else will do. My soul longs for you. We need the completeness of God. We need the mind, the understanding, the will and the purpose of God. Nothing else will do. We need to be utterly harmony and joy to be in eternal heaven. Transform us, Father. Only you can do it. We long for you. Fill us, Father, with your wonderfulness, your lovely, lovely, lovely company forever and ever. Amen. <laughs> Always, Lord, the love of you Ah, something has a go in the meditation of my heart be ever acceptable to thee, O oh God. My thoughts, my will, my whole being touched by the love and the goodness of you, sealed forever in the embrace of your goodness, your loveliness, Lord, the joy of you. That's what we all need. Give us an eternal mindfulness. Likewise, Lord, that we take our place in heaven, in your heavenly host, a blessing to all, an eternal joy to all, and to ourselves, the full and endless awareness of your goodness the blessing that you are. Thank you, Heavenly Father, kind Dad. Thank you, Dad. Well, how to achieve this? What serve as good and lovely think on these things? Thank God for them. You will quickly extend it to things that you thought were a curse, were an evil, now simply to guide you back to God. It all shows you the way. The entire classroom of this universe is eternally showing the way. Training us for heaven. Preparing us. May our eyes be opened. That we see your presence everywhere your hand, your loving care. What's 
So if it's good and lovely, think on these things. You will come to know God. And this is life eternal, according to John 17. To know thee, the only true God, and Jesus, the way, the way to know thee. I am the way, the truth, and the life. No man cometh unto me but by, but by me. Love you, God. Incredibly simple. See the divine, the infinite God, as your dad. Remember that you are his child. And all will be well. Let thankfulness fill your mind, your heart, your mouth, your being. That gratitude drives you into the eternity of his being. Endless heaven. Endless good company. Endless goodness. Thank you, Dad. Now I'm come that you might have life and have it more abundantly. Thank you, Dad.